Good day everyone and welcome back to the channel. In today's news, Meghan Markle acting like a monster towards Prince Harry, the Queen and the rest of the royal family. According to the National Enquirer, the Duchess of Sussex has been tearing the royal family apart for quite some time, but even more so now that she's become a mum. A former royal nanny is quoted as saying, Meghan is a monster, she has to control everything. The suspicious source adds, she was on her third nanny before baby Archie was seven weeks old, and she's so afraid the baby will bond with someone other than herself. She can't stand anyone else holding him. The former nanny also claims to have overheard that a staffer found a nanny in tears outside of Marco and Prince Harry Frogmore Cottage, home outside of London. Marco and Prince Harry had one nanny who was with them for a brief period before being let go for a lapse in professional duties. The second nanny, as Entertainment Tonight clarifies, was only a night nurse who didn't even live in their home. Their current nanny reportedly gets along extremely well with Marco and Prince Harry, who see her as a blessing. This all calls into question the validity of the former royal nanny who supposedly spoke to the magazine. The outlet is deliberately vague when referring to the source, never explicitly confirming if they even work for Marco. Since the Duchess of Sussex has only had two official nannies, with one being let go soon after starting, there is no way for the source to have heard about yet another nanny crying outside of Frogmore. The claims about Marco's refusal to let anyone else handle Archie also ring false. As we mentioned earlier, she and Prince Harry have found the current nanny to be an incredibly help, meaning the Duchess is happy to outsource some tasks to others. These allegations are completely untrue. People magazine, a far more reliable source of information than any tabloid, reported that the Duke and Duchess regularly see the Queen due to their proximity to Windsor Castle. As a former royal staffer told the magazine, it's just a short walk to have tea together on Sundays. There is no rift between Marco and her husband's grandmother. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and I will see you next time. Bye bye.